So now most women would give anything for a smaller bottle, but not my next guest, oh no, because former sugar babe Mutia was so annoyed with her body after the birth of her first child, she decided to get a bum and boob implants and she's here right now not at the same time i hope <laughs> no 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 you have to um you have to leave about six weeks um, i'll bet apart. you do i'll yeah. bet you do so what what was all this about was it just you were just feeling a bit do you know what it was it's just um i thought about it for, for a little while anyway but um i love them i love them yeah, no i just think it's just um you know i wouldn't change anything about them and right. you know i've never been against the whole surgery thing mm. so to me it was to go out there i mean i had I had to build up my confidence anyway because yeah. obviously getting surgery is not the easiest thing but um no but i'm so happy with them really and i just thought you know when i had my daughter you know it was kind of like thing. laying down it all kind of went <laughs> and i just thought to myself why not just you know pull it all back together yeah. and you know get back yourself as and you you morning. feel now more like yourself. yeah no, this is definitely you're supposed to be. i love him was it painful though um, the process, it wasn't as bad as I thought. I thought right. my breasts hurt a lot more, mm. actually, than anything else. Um, actually, I still can't feel my, my right side. Right, okay, <laughs> but it's getting there. It's hopefully. getting there, it's, it's getting, getting there. there but it yeah, does look fine, right. it's very natural. And what about your bottom? What did they do to your bum? It's exactly the same same process, really? yeah. Oh, what, they just put like a wee implant in it is, Yeah, it's just exactly the same thing. But um, it's, again, it was kind of like just everything just all pushes up and yeah. then you know you just don't have to worry about it and especially in the sort of job that you do if you're not feeling confident if you're feeling not mm. happy with your body it's very difficult to then go on and give a yeah. performance you know? no definitely i think you know what it's, it's always it's better to feel better about yourself than not and um you know i just i believe if you want to feel good about yourself no matter what anyone thinks about it you know you shouldn't care about what anyone thinks anyway but um, go for it, no, definitely. No. Is it really expensive? No, no, to tell you the truth, you know what, there's so much um, different ways of um, doing things. I mean, Transform, they're the ones that had, had worked on me. Right. Thank you. Um, and they, you know, they've got different ways of having to pay for things. Oh, right, okay. And, so you don't need You know, they do pay. packages, packages, oh, right, which okay. seems really weird. Gosh, it's like buying a car or something. Yeah, it it's is. very strange. So you feel better, and obviously you're out on your own now, because, uh -huh. you know, obviously we remember you with the sugar babes, but yeah. you're out on your own, and there is more pressure on you when you're on your own. So yeah. I can understand why you want to look the best that you yeah, want to be. Um, you do have a new single out. When I is that do. coming out? End of the month, I think. It comes out on the 27th. 27. It's called Fall In. Um, right. It was done by Agent X and me and Ultra, who's a really good friend of mine um we're doing cool. it together should we have a look yes, here please. we go God, they're very much. To tell you the truth, I just, me as personally, I just don't think the sugar babes. I hope thank that goes you. really well. But so as you're here, I need to ask you about what's happening with the sugar babes. Goodness me, the lineup changes over the years. I can't keep up with it. You know, it's been yeah. extraordinary. There's been so many different changes. And now, well, what what is the state of play? Have you spoken to any of the girls? What's um, happening? I spoke to Keisha, and it's just to tell you the truth, I just, me as personally i just don't think the sugar base is the sugar base anymore i mean it would have been the different original that yeah was it would have been different if the there was start. you know if Keisha had stayed in it and yeah. someone else had gone you know then mm. it'd be sugar base but wow but you know i suppose now there's no original sugar base we should just all reform again why don't you <laughs> you you and Keisha could do uh, you, you know what i mean to tell you the truth it, it's just a nice it's a nice thing to know that i still have contact with both of them yeah, yeah. um and it's just I'm very, I'm quite disappointed. Mm. I'm actually quite disappointed. Obviously, the brand name of Sugar Babes will always carry on. Yeah. But to say that there's no original in the Sugar Babes, it just mm. kind of puts it down a bit. Yeah, it's a bit strange. Mm. I it think everybody strange. was quite, quite shocked because we weren't yeah. sure. Because first of all, we heard Amelia was going. That right. was the thing. That she was, she was going. Then she wasn't going. And then, so it's all, it's all going a bit mad. Did they all fall out, or was it just? What do you think? No, happened? I mean, to tell you the truth, I mean, I heard there was rumours about Keisha being a bully, but I'd say that's all lies. I mean. You know, the reasons why people had left is not because of, you know, of bullying, mm. to tell you the truth. I think everyone, you know, everyone's got their own opinion about things, but they're all grown women. Yeah. You know, no, if, you know, no one's going to allow another woman to, mm. but like, I would never let another mm. person bully me. So it's a whole bullying 
you know, subject. Yeah. I think it's all rubbish. Well, I could see the two of you getting together, you know, and be, and be sugar sugar women. Well, you know, I mean, we're all growing <laughs> up. I haven't been with the sugar race for so long. No, and, it's a long time. You know, and I've had my, my years of growing up and mm. learning about what I want in life and sure. getting to look after my daughter. So, you know, hooking up with the rest of the girls, you know, I think that could be an amazing idea. It's a great idea. Definitely. It's a great idea. Good luck with the new single. Thank you. And uh, with the new boobs. Oh, yeah. looking very, very perky. Thank, Thank you. you very much indeed. <laughs>